Hey guys, welcome back to the Judah Way of Life. My name's David, this is Isaac. We're gonna continue on this theme of nogi. And, well, so, <laughs> my nogi is very similar to my gi. Uh, I prefer ashwaza and koshwaza techniques still. Now, the one we're gonna to do today, we're gonna to look at haragoshi. So we're gonna look at it as a, a direct attack, so how I would sort of set it up and how I would execute it. And then towards the end of the video, we'll do a bit of a, a bonus where we're looking at it from a scenario where it's... Um, counter. Yeah, as a counter. Thank you, Isaac. My brain was not processing information properly there. Uh, yeah, we'll look at it as a counter and, and how to sort of capitalise on an attack from, from your opponent. All right, so, so with... Um, I'm going to be looking at taking hold on the, the, the wrist. Um, I'm going to be getting close. I'm going to put this on the hook right here. Uh, I'm going to be sort of clamping on the shoulder and keeping tight. Once I've got close, so I'm just starting off here, trying to get close. I'm going to want to move this hand up onto the uh, outside of the tricep and I'm pinning this arm here. I'm bringing my head in nice and close and I want to keep tight here. So that when I'm able to turn, I'm bringing Isaac's weight onto this leg, the front leg. So I'm tight here with my head and then I'm tight here. And I'm pulling this down and I'm pulling this in. So I'm keeping Isaac tight and I've got my head and I'm pushing into the side of Isaac's head here so everything's nice and tight. And I'm going to step. As soon as I step, Isaac's moving with me, right? I don't want to step and then too much space to open up here. Okay, I'm going to stay nice and close. I'm going to step, Isaac's there, and I'm able to bring my leg through and get the, the sweep connection through there. Now, so here, I'm stepping. See, I'm angling my foot out as I step, but then I continue the rest of the, the pivot on that right foot as this leg comes through. So, from here, as this leg comes through, that's where I'm turning the rest of my supporting legs. In this example, it's my, my right leg, so I'm doing this to the left. So, stepping open, as my leg comes through, point my toes, and then I'm able to finish off with the, the sweeping action for the Haragoshi. So in here, yeah, pulling myself in tight, I want to be in close here, bring my hip towards me as I step here, turn, leg, and I'm bringing the leg through, keeping my toes pointed, and I'm bringing it in, sweeping Isaac's legs out of the way. Just a point on this, when you're throwing, you want to make sure you're not over, over throwing with yourself. So I don't want to be coming through, and then rolling here, and then then my partner get on top. So it's important that you apply the amount of energy you need, you can throw, and then you're able to drop down in a dominant position, you don't want to be rolling through with it. Instead of the beginning, we're going to look at this little bonus bit now. So, this works here. If you're on this Yeah. So, from here, if they shoot for the, the single leg, the visor comes in here, start this position. Right? So, he comes up, he kicks my leg. Yeah, so I'm going to find a hook in initially to be able to try and get my um, posture, right? So, I just been trying to take it for the single leg so he drives into me now. I'm able to hop. I want to go to control here. I'm going to hook my leg in, like so, like an Ochi Gary kind of position. Um, but depending if this leg's for the forward, I might come in for like Koji here. See, here, or here. I'm to here. Straight away, I'm on the 
the arm bit. I'm going to try and step and I'm pulling it in tight and then I'm taking hold, I come over and I'm taking hold of the other triceps. So I'm turning my hand in and I'm putting pressure on Isaac here. Okay? And now I'm going to use his momentum against him. So as Isaac's pushing me, so as I was pushing me here, I'm going to turn that foot and I keep this tension. So, so you're going to keep that tension, pull them forwards, you're going to swing that leg through and go. And as you saw by so that example there, uh, it can be quite a lot of energy in this and you want to be careful that you, you don't roll through like I just did because you're going to lose that control. I mean, you could argue that that's better than getting taken down yourself. At least you're back on your feet and you break away. But still, you want to be trying to land in a dominant position. So we just go through it again. I'm just going to shoot for the leg. Comes in here straight away. I'm getting my legs back so I can position, hook my leg in to make it harder for Isaac to lift. On the, um, around the back here, on the opposite, I'm tight on this tricep. I'll show you in a second this way around. And then from here, if Isaac keeps pushing, I'm able to hop, turn, and then just bring, bring it through. So we do it this way. Comes in a hook, tight here, tight over. He keeps pushing, turn, and over. And obviously in a position to drop to the ground and control. Or you can just do it straight off the grip if you're fast. Harigashi, no grip on an underhook, or if they come from the leg and you, you go to defend, hook in, hop, and go for the, the harai. So this is the throw that Isaac can do. So <laughs> if he's got his cat agreement, I've got my harigashis. Alright, there's balance, balance in the world. Alright, so uh, speaking of which, again, I'm going to watch the cat agreement video. Uh, Isaac's done part one, which is with the gi, part two is with the no gi, and then uh, you got this. Alright, gosh, go on and play around with it, have some fun, see what you think. We'll see you again next time. Bye bye.